Hey, it's Alex. Welcome back to my channel. In today's video, as you would have seen by the title, I am going to be trying different snack foods from around the world because I don't know about you, but I love watching people try food on camera. I have like a weird fetish for it. If it's ever in my subscription feed, someone's trying food, I'm like, oh, yes, and watch it straight away. So hopefully you enjoy it too because that is what I'm going to be doing today. I got sent this a little while ago, actually quite a while ago. It's been in the cupboard. I was going to do it before I left to South Africa. Didn't get the time, but yes. So I got sent this from Munchpack. I haven't been like, well, that's my address, huh? I haven't been like paid to do a video. I didn't have to do a video. They were just kind enough to send it to me and I thought it'd be pretty cool. So yeah, that's what I'm going to be doing today. Ryan, yeah. do you want to come try snacks with me? Right. It's lonely doing it on your own. Yeah. And Ryan's going to join me. You excited to try some snacks? I need to find a new snack tasting buddy. I think someone who's a little more enthusiastic. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> All right, no. so, ooh, this was packed by Roxanne in beautiful sunny Arizona, apparently. Thanks, Roxanne. Look at all these snacks. I'm so excited. So these are all random snacks from around the world. And the first thing I'm looking at is a glazed popcorn birthday cake flavor. Of course. What on earth? I wish I could see where these places, like where these are from, but you can't. It doesn't really Probably, say. Uh, do they not just get them all from America? No, it's all from all around the world. Oh, it's a bit sticky. Birthday cake. I haven't tasted anything worth they cake before. I had protein shake once that was out. Mmm! A very it tastes sticky like, head, hey. If you're Australian, you've probably tasted the rainbow popcorn. It tastes like that, hey? Mmm. Mm. It's good, very sticky. But it's gluten free. Huh? <laughs> Yummy! Next one. Cheetos! Um, oh, yeah. It's in Asian writing. Yeah, so I'm like confused. But I'm guessing it's like the Cheetos. It's a rib. What? It has a rib on it. Oh, so maybe it's like a different flavor. Oh, we'll find out. Interesting. Ooh, it looks different. These are all gonna get stale on us. No, they won't. Oh, no, because I wrap them up after. I'm just smashing them up. Yeah, they're like, because normally Cheetos are like. Yeah. Um, you know, the fiery hot ones are like orange. These are like coated in what looks like. Oh! I don't know. They pepper. smell like two minute noodles. Chicken noodles. Oh, chicken they noodles. do! Rib. Steak. Literally. It's like barbecue steak. Yeah. What's this? Oh, a little token. <laughs> oh, they're quite good, aren't they? They are good. I really like that. Different. They're like a more barbecue flavored chicken twisty. I would say that they're the taste of barbecue ribs. Yeah. Mm -mm. I need to stop eating them. I'm supposed to be healthy today. More chips. Yay. These are Great Lakes potato chips, kettle cooked, parmesan ranch, potato chips. There's like so many good things in there. I just want to get them all out. I know. How exciting is this? I actually love this. You love it. What flavour? Parmesan, Parmesan Ranch. Yum. They have a good selection of flavours, eh? Mm. Mm. Yeah, because it's like a bunch of stuff that I wouldn't pick up myself. Mm. These are really good. Tastes like what it oh, says, yum. Parmesan and, and Ranch. They are really good. <laughs> They're delicious. I think you will be finishing off these later. Yep. This is a double. This looks crazy. I wonder where these are from. It's like a pastry with cream in it. Made in that's made vanilla and strawberry filling. Alright, let's try this. I'm a bit worried about this. It's been in the cupboard for a while. <laughs> it's alright. I'm sure it's gonna be fine. It's all packaged. Oh my gosh. Oh, look at this. It's like a bread roll. Yeah, it's a, <laughs> take a bite. It's like a pastry. <laughs> I was just gonna split it oh, up. I wanna see inside. From. Yeah, it's just raspberry and vanilla inside. Pretty hectic. Mm. I'm not really into pastries, eh? I am. It's 
It's not like the first thing I choose to eat if I was to go to a bakery, but. I'm sure it'd be better if we ate it straight away. Mm. <laughs> the strawberry taste, which is to it be expected, but it tastes quite artificial flavoring, mm. doesn't it? Which is kind of weird in a pastry. Yeah, don't mind. This one? Yeah, I was keen to see these. Alright. So these I'm are they're cool. all just different kind of things. Like I know. How cool is this? Uh, I can't. I, I'm like looking. In I know. Stop! I need to close the box. <laughs> Next are these Korea. Korea. We actually know where these are from. Yay! Korea number one brand. Ooh, pepperoni. Okay, Shout out so, to the Koreans. Yeah, these are nude, a chocolate filled biscuit. Yummy. This is oh. cool. I know, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, wow. Little chocolate straw. It's like a um, mm. pretzel with chocolate in it. Yeah, yum. Thank you. Mm. If you're ever in Korea, get some of these. They're good. Or just get a munch pack. Yeah. Literally, I'm not even like, they didn't even say I had to do a video, but I'm like, glad I do. Did you hear my English just then? Yeah, I'm glad English. I did. I'm glad I did this video because this stuff Schnicks is awesome. around the world. Yeah. Okay, so this is by Nestle. It is a. Oh my God, how Coco Cell. Coco Cell. It is a co cookie filled with coconut cream. Mm. Mm. Hey. Not, I don't really like coconut stuff. Oh, I love wafers. I knew it was a wafer. Yeah, I can tell by the size of it. Can I snap it? Yeah. It's coconut. Very oh. coconutty. Mm. I like it. I yeah. do like coconut and wafers. If you like coconut, you'll love this. I'm not into coconut, so. I can't get my hand out of the box. <laughs> I won't be reaching for this one, but it's alright. Now there's coffee in here. I probably won't try that because that means I've to make a coffee and I've had lots of caffeine today. <laughs> alright, let's try this one. This is weird, Alex. This one sounds weird. Cow tails. Cow, yeah, cow tails, crispy um, crispy rice with cow tails bits. What? No, 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 no. It didn't just say that, did it? Uh, utterly delicious. It yeah, 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 it did say that. <laughs> it didn't say cow tails. Yeah. Like it doesn't have bits of cow tail yeah. in it. Cow tail bits. Should we be scared? No way. Where's the ingredients? <laughs> He's like actually making sure there's, there's so no many ingredients. Fragments uh, of cow tail in it. I think maybe cow tails is like their like like you know like Maltesers, like with bits of Malteser, like anything. It's just their brand, maybe, like their signature thing. Cow tails. Yes, it is. So cow tails is like a chocolate. A or different something. chocolate, yeah. Okay. Yes, I was worried. <laughs> Those things on top, that's cow tails. I was a bit worried that it was cow tails. You that's don't funny. ever know, really. Yeah. I love we still have this cow. There's actually cow tails on it. I know. Oh. Is it melted? A little bit. You it looks it. like an that's, LCM bar. That's all you. Cattail. It's good. It's fine. I believe you. That those little things. Are you not really gonna try it? I can smell it. Do you actually think there's cowtail in it or something? There is. No, there's not. It said on the back. No, it didn't. You're a liar. <laughs> what does that taste like? It does taste like an LCM bar. With those With Milky Way the things on top taste like caramel and like vanilla. Swirling. I feel like it's just like a lunchbox. Tastes it's good. Cool. Pretty unhealthy one, but like from around the world. Yeah. <laughs> Should we try this weird looking thing? Yeah, I'm like so excited. Do you reckon that's Japanese right? Yogurt now? jelly. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I think that might be Japanese. I mean, look, it's either Korean or Japanese. Oh, it's like mushy. I know. I'm actually really scared about this one. I'm not into like liquid foods. You know, I couldn't tell you. Could be Korean, could be Japanese. How are you supposed to go about this? I reckon it's Korean. Okay. Oh, that looks nice. What is it? Oh, I thought it was like an actual liquid thing. Oh, yep. Mm. Mm. It tastes like rose water at first. Mm. That's some good jelly. That was a good, I literally thought that was a liquid for some reason. Really? Yeah. Anyway. We'll be in a different package. Go to yeah. the Australian one. Yeah. Oh, these two are Australian. Both yeah, of them. Yeah, I think they're both are. Mm. Unless Warheads is American. I've tried the Warheads. Although, have you ever seen Milo biscuits? No. 
Wait, this isn't Australian, it's not even Australian. Galetas Relinas. Oh, I thought um, my was Australian. Bueno, what is that language? For Pakut Energia. Gracias. Gracias, Saturitas. Maybe uh, Spanish? Spanish? I don't know. We'll find out. <laughs> Milo. I'm sure people biscuits. will tell us if they recognize this stuff. I'm keen on those other ones. They're from Australia. Milo biscuit coming in. Oh, this half No. Mmm. Mmm. Rubber. Mmm. 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 Tastes like a chocolate biscuit. All right, last one. We all know this from Australia. Warhead. Extreme sour warheads. How many can we put in our mouths? Oh Find God. out now. <laughs> How many you want? Like one. No. <laughs> Just that's, pour them in. That's not how you do it. Pour them in our mouth. Yeah, these are pretty sour. Oh. They're extreme sour. Do, do, do. Not too many. Oh. Is they good? Are they sour? A lot. They will be. Mm-mm-mm. Are they sour? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh. I got ya. Mm. Oh. oh my god. I got it back. Oh my god. I can't do it. <laughs> Alright, I'm going away now. I'm going to burn all my day, Oh, How sour is that? Mm. What about bad? It's sour, you. bro. <laughs> Look at you. Well, I had like 10. If you're like an actor who needs to cry on demand, just like pop a warhead and you'll be right. <laughs> <laughs> and it's, it's good when, oh my god. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 12. You have 12 warheads in your mouth. Yeah, mate. We well, go back down here. Beat that. <laughs> that was good. And then it's good when the sour goes away, then they actually taste pretty good. I just didn't want to eat them all. Well, there you go. I really hope you enjoyed watching us try some different foods from around the world. We loved most of them. 10 out of 7, and no, 10 out of 7. Huh. <laughs> 130% of them were good. Yeah, 7 out of 10 I think we really actually enjoyed and we'll probably continue eating. <laughs> but I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up if you did and subscribe to my channel if you want to see more videos from me. And I'll see you in my next one.